Archbishop Tutu's work to not only in South Africa's apartheid system, but to also maintain peace after its fall drew praise from across the world. Fox 6's Sam Kramer is live at Marquette University, where Tutu was honored nearly two decades ago. Yeah, hi there, Gabrielle. Tutu became just the sixth person since 1969 to receive the Pere Marquette Discovery Award. It's the university's highest honor given to those who achieve an extraordinary breakthrough in advancing humanity. Shortly after, Marquette created a study abroad program in South Africa where students and faculty shared experience with Tutu firsthand. In the eyes of those who knew him. He's probably one of the most extraordinary people I've ever met. Archbishop Desmond Tutu never gave in to fear. Robert Deal formed a relationship with Tutu, first as a Catholic priest in Cape Town, South Africa, where Tutu used his pulpit to advocate for black, mixed race, and Indian South Africans all suffering during the apartheid. It was always his courage and his purpose to go where people hurt most and give them hope. After the apartheid's end in 1990, then President Nelson Mandela chose Tutu to chair the Truth and Reconciliation Commission, work that would ultimately lead to his Nobel Peace Prize. Both victim and victimizer would come and tell their stories and come to reconcile with each other and make peace rather than bloodshed. That's what brought Tutu to Marquette. He received the university's highest honor in 2003 for breakthrough work that advanced humanity. Deal then grew closer to Tutu as the university's dean of the College of Professional Services, helping develop a study abroad program in South Africa for students to learn from someone he calls one of the most important people of the 20th century. There was such an opportunity for combining the sense of social justice uh, servant leadership, service to people and their studies for our students. And who better to exemplify that than Desmond Tutu? And Deal says Tutu would always make time for those Marquette students studying abroad in South Africa. He says he's had conversations with those students about their time with Tutu. They all had the same description. It was a life-changing experience. Reporting live tonight on the campus of Marquette University, Sam Kramer. Fox 6 News. What a great live story. Sam, thank you.